Soundtrap is an online music studio, but it's a great tool to use to create student podcasts and to share them. When you first sign in, you're taken to your profile page. We want to create a podcast, so select the button that says Enter Studio. From here, we're going to select a blank template, and we're ready to record our audio. To record your audio, move to the left-hand side of the screen and select Add New Track. We want to pick Voice and Microphones, and now we're ready to record. By default, Soundtrap has different audio enhancement for vocals. If you're recording a podcast, simply select Dry. And now, we're ready to record. Move your cursor to the bottom of the screen and select Record. I'm now recording my podcast using Soundtrap.com. Now that I'm done recording, I'm going to press stop. I can then listen to my audio by taking the playhead, bringing it to the front of the clip, and either hitting the play button at the bottom side of the screen, or by hitting the space bar. I'm now recording my podcast using Soundtrap.com. Now I also want a music bed to go underneath my audio. So I'm going to go to the middle of the screen and select Import File. This will let me choose the music that I want to put underneath my audio recording. Now if I take my playhead, bring it to the beginning of the track, I can listen to the podcast that I created. I'm now recording my podcast using Soundtrap.com. Okay, now the last edit that I need to make is to trim my music, which is a lot longer than my audio. So to make us to split a clip or to make an edit, select the clip and select Control E. The clip is now split. I'm going to get rid of the part that I don't need. And now I have my podcast. Now I want to share my podcast. First, I'm going to change the name of the song. Then I want to select Save. If I select this download arrow, my track will automatically download as an MP3. The other option I have is to share my song through a link. If I select my track, and the share button, it's going to automatically give me a direct URL, which I can then share with the world. I'm now recording my podcast using Soundtrap.com. Create your own podcast today. Go to www.soundtrap.com and create an account.